Hey y'all, happy Sunday. Today is March 24th. It is my son Blake's eighth birthday and it is like almost five o'clock in the evening. So we've had a good day. Um, he enjoyed all his gifts and everything. In a minute, we're gonna go out and get uh, some ice cream. I think we might just get a ice cream cake cause that's what, you know, sounds good to him. He wants pizza, so we'll pick that up. Y'all, it's so windy today. The winds are like 35 miles per hour. It's insane how the trees are shaking. Um, if I'm talking weird, my mouth is like really sore, so that's why. But as I'm standing here, my hubby is finishing up my bookshelves in my office area, and I want to show y'all. Now, excuse the mess. My desk is a mess, but let me just show y'all what we got. All right, so here's how it's looking. So this is my desk. I did move it, and I like that I'm facing, like, the window, and I can look outside, and it'll give me, like, really good lighting as well. But here are my bookshelves. These are the Billy bookcases from ikea i did opt for the ones with the doors because i do have my book collection as you guys know so i want to put my books in there but also in here i can store away like my um nail supplies and stuff in these so that it's not so visible baby you did an amazing job they look so good thank you so much but yeah i'm so happy with them guys let me back up show y'all all right so this is how it looks here with the bookshelves y'all i was like i could get two more and do a whole wall of bookshelves but i don't want to um these at the bottom need to get scooted closer together but what i do want to do is add a chair so i'm going to do like a cozy a big oversized chair here and obviously i'm going to hang curtains i did bring this rug from my bedroom into here and i like it because it kind of matches the vibe of the house and it really warms up the space there's a lot of white in here i know my chair doesn't match i do plan to get another chair because that's just me that's just how i am like i can't live with my chair being so off but also like there's gonna be a lot of colorful things in here i'm not sure if the rug is even staying in here i just know that it's in here for now we wanted to try it i might end up getting another one something way more neutral because like i said there'll be a lot of colors in here but for now i really like it y'all let me know what you think also thank you babe you did that period <laughs> but anyways y'all i'm about to um go in here let me show y'all the kids they are having fun with these balloons that my husband blew for them so they're having a great time right now blake happy birthday they're just playing with balloons there's food on the floor i gotta clean up before we leave this house um they're having fun with the air purifier i got because it's blowing them like a fan <laughs> i have it on high <laughs> here's our birthday boy happy birthday blake you're eight today you like all your gifts yeah so he's having fun with the air purifier there's not many updates today i haven't well that's not true i did some stuff in the bathroom but i wanted to show you how much stuff these hold like look at this it's full like all of our homeschool stuff was able to fit in these so i definitely recommend them they're so sleek looking and we have more room to put like more stuff in here so i like them a lot a whole lot but yeah i kind of just wanted to check in today not much is going on here we're getting ready to head out in a little while and go pick up the food and stuff or whatever and um i don't know what else we're gonna do today i'll probably go ahead and put some books on my bookshelves and like start unpacking my nail stuff because your girl is ready to make some nails honey okay <laughs> right like <laughs> these got to go I just been looking at my hands in disgust. I want my nails done. Once you start doing your own nails, you'll be like, oh, I need to do my nails. So I really want to get to that. So I might start on that tonight. Wow, Definitely going to be doing that tomorrow. Tomorrow, my husband's vacation ends. He'll be back to work. Everything will be back to normal. We got to get back to homeschool and regular life and all that. But anyway, just checking in on y'all. I will see y'all later. Hey, y'all. So we finally left the house. It's like 5.30. Turn right at the stop sign. Um, and yes, we need a GPS because uh, we're new here. Anyways, we're about to go pick up a uh, cake and then the food. Blake, you wanted some pizza. Hey, Blake. Hey. Happy birthday, man. 
<laughs> so that's what we're getting today. And then we're gonna go back home. Y'all, it's crazy windy today and i'm so tired i was really like we're gonna have a day where we don't do that much um i just chill you know tomorrow's like back to normal or whatever but we did the most today but i'm happy with the progress we've been unpacking i'll probably finish unpacking the bathroom and call it a day i might not even do that today you know it might be a tomorrow thing but we got a, a lot of boxes out of the house like seriously the um remaining boxes oh gosh the remaining boxes are mostly my office stuff so yeah happy about that but i'm definitely tired <laughs> i was sitting here reading y'all's comments um my first video just dropped today uh the like new house tour move in with us vlog y'all are showing us so much love we really appreciate it like the comments really make my day they make me smile i be like sending screenshots to my husband like look at this comment <laughs> y'all are so nice so thank y'all so so much um but yeah, we're just headed out. I don't even know if we're gonna go by the little lake or pond or whatever um, today. So yeah, oh, we'll see. But I just wanted to bring my camera out and see how I liked it um, in all kind of lightings and settings and stuff or whatever. But yeah, I will check in with y'all a little bit later. Monday it's a brand new week I'm feeling refreshed ready to start the new week um, getting back to routines back to homeschool back to working and grinding and everything my husband's back at work um, I'm actually getting ready to go uh, set up my office like unpack all my stuff of course I'm gonna take y'all in there with me but first I gotta get me some water sorry I sound a little scratchy I ended up at the urgent care last night like yesterday evening and um yeah so that's a whole thing but i don't even want to i don't even want to talk about it not right now but um i might think give me some ice for my cup y'all i'm really loving this new cup it's so cute i love any cup that'll keep your water cold you know i made this water last night and it's still cold but i'm gonna just add some ice to it because I like it real, real cold. And I love having this ice tray in the refrigerator, in the freezer, like, so nice. So my plan this week is to kind of get back on track with, like, tracking my calories and um, eating in a deficit and also, like, exercising. I'm starting 75 soft literally one week from today, but I kind of just want to go ahead and throw my body back into the groove of doing things because it's been, like, months of me not being on track which is not good and i had to get on the scale at the doctor and i was horrified just being honest so your girl is getting back on track starting today actually so i'm gonna make it my goal to drink three of these um before the day is out that's a lot of the problem i'm having i need to drink more water yeah so we're gonna do that but i'm excited to get back on track and show y'all what's coming today hi sydney girl I got my baby. Um, she's downstairs with me. She's finishing up her breakfast. You're doing so, you're eating all your food, your apples too. I'm proud of you. But yeah, y'all, the house is looking, it's looking better. Like everything's not put together. Like I still gotta unbox the like bins for the pantry and get that stuff organized, but it has not been a priority. But right now what's a priority is um, my office. So I'm gonna go ahead and get in there and get started. All right, y'all. In the office, I gotta let some light in because we need our natural light. All right, that's good. Excuse this broom. This is my husband's like outdoor broom. I'm actually about to take it in the garage real quick because yeah, I got to go. I think this is the right light. So yesterday, my hubby installed these um, Billy bookcases from Ikea. They look really good. I'm gonna give them like a quick wipe down today. And then I want to get my stuff unboxed. I had one, two, three, four. I think I had four boxes that have like my nail supplies in it. So I do want to get that done today. Your girl is missing having nails. So if I get it done, then maybe I can treat myself by making myself some nails or whatever. So that is top, top, top of my priority list. So yeah, we're going to get started on that right now. Usually I don't post. Post, but I want the world to know. So I know for a fact that my books are in this box right here. Oh gosh. And also, 
this box right here. So I have two medium sized boxes of books. And I might have room for more books. If not, y'all, I might end up getting some more shelves. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Let me see what's the easiest. I kind of want to organize these, but I want to get them out. So let's take them out, put them on the desk, and then organize them on the shelves. Oh my gosh. Oh, the struggle is real. This is so heavy. Time to pull a drop top out. Summer nights, it's a vibe, yeah. I miss my book so much. Netflix and chilling, I, Didn't wanna share I know this lighting is trash, but if you're new here, hello, I'm Sean, and I'm kind of a bookie. Yeah, I like reading psychological thrillers for fun. I'm also into fantasy, so if that is you, hey girl, hey, we can share books. One box down. Oh, dear God, help me, it's so heavy. Let me put y'all over here, friends. Like I said, it is such... A cloudy day that the lighting is just trash. Did I mention I was obsessed with my camera? Because I'm obsessed with my camera. Which one of my kids is that? Come here, baby. Wanna help mama? Get all my books out the box. Huh? You do? Alright. Sydney's gonna help me. We're gonna put them on the paper. So these are your daddy's books, so I'm gonna just put these to the side. Thank you, baby. It's like a fingerprint. Is that cool? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's like my little notebook. A cute butterfly book. I know, and this is a good read, girl. Ew. I'm gonna save all these books for you. When you get bigger, you can read them too. All right, thank you, baby. Thank you for your help. Mommy loves you. All right, this box is empty. Let's break it down. Mm -hmm. It's called The Wolf and the Witch. I'm about to flip it all around, show y'all all my books, and then we're gonna start putting them on the shelves. All right, so this is what we're working with so far. Here's all my books. My baby is hiding. Say hi, baby. <laughs> Here's all the books. My little mini collection. And I definitely wanna buy more, so yeah, I'm probably gonna buy another shelf. We'll see, I really wanna put a chair here. But anyway, let's get them put on these shelves. So I think I'm gonna start with like, Pretty series first. So this is the first one. We're gonna work on this one. All right, y'all, so this is what I have so far. Look, I have room for new books, which I'm stoked about, okay? I love getting new books. This is how it's looking. I'm definitely gonna go through and like reorganize and categorize. I think I'll do like thrillers over here on the left and my fantasy books over here on the right. Excuse the noise. The trash truck is outside. It's looking so good, I'm so happy. Okay, so we got the books done for now, and now I gotta work on my nail supplies. All right, now that we have the books on there, I brought the boxes over that have like nail supplies. They heavy too, but I'm gonna try to get one of these up on this desk. It's not as heavy as the books, sheesh. Oh, I missed my stuff so much. Ah! I'm just so happy, like I have new stuff. I haven't even used it. I'm so happy to see it. So here's one box of all my nail supplies, y'all. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. Like my millions of charms and just everything. I'm so excited. My like uh, press on supplies when I'm shipping out orders. Y'all, this just makes my heart feel so good. I'm so excited to open everything up. So let's do it. I won't even lie to y'all. Seeing all this stuff is a tad bit overwhelming because like I have so much stuff and you don't know until you pull everything out and see it. But I have so much stuff and then in this little thing right here, one of my metallic gel paints opened up. It spilled over everything. I could smell it, it's so strong. I'm gonna have to put gloves on and try to like clean it off with my 91% alcohol and clean everything off. But I hate that that happened. Ugh. But I'm probably gonna just 
deal with that last because that's so annoying. Honestly, I'm probably gonna throw them away and buy some more. Ain't nobody got time for that. Those things actually leak a lot. <sighs> yeah, my husband just went to the pharmacy to pick up my medicine. I was on the phone with him a little bit, trying to decide if I wanted him to get me a drink or like, if I make me something, I'll probably make me a tea here in just a minute. It's probably for the best because your girl don't feel that good. He picked up, I, the doctor put me back on antibiotics and like anti-nausea medicine because I've been dealing with nausea really bad. <sighs> Anyways, hopefully I get to feeling better a lot soon, like ASAP, ASAP. They gave me my first dose of medicine last night while I was at the doctor. They were like, we're gonna give you your first dose right now. <laughs> they felt so bad for me. And then all the pharmacies were closed. I was okay with waiting a, another day. Like if I already don't feel good, what's one more day, you know? But I'm so happy to see all my stuff. About to get my nails popping, back up and popping. I'm ready to like create. Um, seeing all my stuff makes me feel creative. Having to be the one to put all the stuff up does not make me feel creative whatsoever. Like it actually stresses me out a little bit, but I'm definitely gonna organize it. One side will be like packing uh, stuff. So like things I use for packing orders, that'll all go on one side and the other side will be like stuff I actually use to make nails, charms, etc. I also have this little uh, cart here for like everyday stuff. And I'm thinking I might actually put my nail polishes in that cart. That way, you know, I can roll it right here beside me, pull out whatever colors I need. I really think that's a good idea. So I might do that um, and keep my lamp in there. Cause I don't want to keep anything on my desk all the time, except for my like proper lamp. When I say my lamp, I mean like my UV LED lamp, but I'll keep my desk lamp on the desk. But anyway, we got to put all this stuff up. But I'm going to go get my medicine, make some tea, and then we'll come back. All right, y'all. I'm back. I have my tea here. Just trying to boost my immune system. I got all this stuff over here on my desk. And I'm about ready to start organizing it under here. I think I decided that I'm going to do, like, in between the books, some, like, display stands with some of my nail designs on it. Because yeah. that's cute. So what I was thinking about as far as like display stands was like something like this. Sorry about the window. But something like these would be really cute. Hmm. They have this longer one. I don't know, I'm a little picky. They have these. So they're just clear stands here. I think I'm gonna order this one. It'll come tomorrow. That's just to display like cute nails I've made. Nothing that I need, but it's a want that I'm gonna have, period. Um, anyways, let's get started on this other side. Good morning, y'all. Happy Tuesday. Um, today is doo -doo -doo, March 26th. Y'all, <laughs> I just want to hop on here because yesterday I need to charge my camera and then I just ended up doing a lot of stuff off camera as far as getting like my little office area set up. So I wanna show y'all like where we're at and what we're gonna be working on today. I'm actually gonna be going upstairs to try to work on my closet and my bathroom because I'm just tired of it. I'm tired of it looking like it's looking. So that's definitely on the agenda for today, but I'm about to show y'all like how these uh built in, like how the cabinets turned out. I think I showed y'all that side, maybe not. I'll just show y'all both, but we'll start here because this one I like the best. So this is how this side is looking. And it's so organized. I have like my nail tips, all of those here. And then my like nail brushes and stuff and some pens. And then here's like all my like stuff to do designs and stuff. So like chrome powders, more chrome powders, glitter, nail files, buffers, tools, just extra stuff I do nail art with is all here and then charms. And then down here is like stuff I don't use as frequently. It's all down here. Um, I bought myself a label printer back there. I'm so excited. I uh, tested it out. I bought it before we moved. So I haven't gotten to like label anything yet, but yeah, just all the stuff I need for nails is in here. And I stole those bins out of my pantry, so we'll see if I need some more because I want to work on the pantry too. And then over here, I plan, so like these are all my nail polishes. And I have to um, get them out of this box today. And I've started like putting some in these drawers here. 
So I think I'm gonna use these drawers for like nail polishes. Then I have my lamp here, of course my a-L-E-X-A. -E I actually renamed her so I could say that. <laughs> and then my gloves. So yeah, everything's looking pretty good. I have to reorganize all the charms, so that's why they're still sitting here. I usually use my iPad when I'm doing nails. I've been sitting here. This side of my desk over here will be like where I keep my like computer and stuff set up. And then this longer piece will be for like my nails. These are the containers I got for organizing underneath the sink in the bathroom this is probably not enough i'll have to order another set but this is a good start so we're gonna take these upstairs and get started on that and i gotta figure out what i'm gonna do with this cart i'm thinking about putting it in this closet and rolling it in and out with stuff that we use so i might keep some of the kids like homeschool stuff in here or games or whatever we'll see i might think that'll be good i'm sick of looking at this box this is just the mirror that goes above this table i'm just not ready to hang it up yet because i'm not i don't know i may want a different mirror like you know what I mean? So I don't know. So haven't made that decision yet. And this little bed dash just slides under my bed. This goes in my bedroom. And then just a bag of like, you know, paper and stuff that comes out of packages. So yeah, it's coming together y'all. I'm just missing my chair. I'm still debating on getting another shelf or not. For right now, I like it the way it is. Cause if I put a chair and a lamp there, I want to be able to access the outlet back there. So yeah, I just haven't made a decision, but it's definitely, definitely coming together. All right, I'm back upstairs in my bathroom. Now, the last time I showed y'all the bathroom, it pretty much looked like I was done. <laughs> kind of found out there was a whole nother box of stuff that needs to be dealt with. So, I want to do that. I'm so tempted to just go in my closet and do that first because it's so much easier. But I know I need to go ahead and tackle the bathroom because it looks a little chaotic. Let me show you. Like, this is the box that I realized I you know forgot about i was like oh this isn't bad and like here's the rest of the stuff that has to get put away and then i have stuff all here here are the containers i brought up and then some more stuff there so yeah what i did the other day like putting stuff in here yeah this ain't gonna work it wasn't gonna work anyway oh i gotta sneeze hold on anyway it wasn't gonna work regardless because i feel like this doesn't maximize space honestly we'll see i'm making stack three so then I'll have to order some more. I'll see if I can get them today. If not, they'll come tomorrow. And then for my husband's side, I may or may not get him some because he don't have that much stuff, y'all. <laughs> He's very minimal. And then for in here, I'll just use the containers that I already have, like the bins and stuff that I already have. This is organized like cleaning on this side. And then I think like hair stuff will go on this side. Maybe our toothpaste and stuff will go in one of these. We'll see. I need to order some more like ASAP. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I have no idea how to put these together. Hmm. Interesting. I thought I would have moved on. This is mostly hair stuff, which I'm just gonna organize into the middle. That should be easy. When we're moving, everything got like taped up, so I'm gonna hurry up and try to get all this off. So that you know i can just organize everything as quickly as i can i'm not trying to be all day doing this especially because like most of the house at this point is already like i don't want to say put together but it's unpacked so i want to get our bathroom unpacked too sorry i'm sniffling y'all it is so it's so cold i have to turn the heat on because it's like 30 something degrees and it's warming up but it's only gonna warm up to like 50 something so yeah these were all packaged like this so nothing was spilled since it was traveling a little distance all i really want to do today is literally my nails and my toes and like do me a cute spring mani pedi set whatever but no i have to unpack my bathroom <clears throat> so we'll know where stuff is plus i do need to do mine and my daughter's hair like Take it out and wash it. So I need all this stuff <clears throat> to be unpacked. Mm -hmm. Probably try to find another solution, but for now, 
this will do. So I am just gonna put like lotion and stuff my husband uses right here. And then if need be, I'll put these cleaning supplies in the linen closet. But for now, for now, they seem to be okay. I went ahead and ordered another set of these. They'll be here in a couple hours or so. But for now, I'm gonna go ahead and start, um, <laughs> wow, upside down. I'm gonna go ahead and start filling these with some stuff. No idea, but I have so much stuff. So like, obviously like sanitary type of stuff I'll put in here. Hmm. Will that close? No. I mean, no harm, but I'm throwing these away because I don't use these. So we got a container free. Cute. All right. They do come with the feet on the bottom. Maybe I should do that first, you would think. Y'all, let me tell you how I need to get my entire life together. Because this is like literally the bottom. Like BFFR. Mm. Okay, this is the bottom. Jeez. To be honest, I don't think about you. To be honest, I got better things to do. I will say it doesn't hold a lot, so like the extra stuff I'll probably put behind the bed. Over been fine since you told me you don't love me anymore. To be honest, I like sleeping alone. love this bag it came so in handy on the road trip like this is the cutest bag ever just being so for real y'all i'm gonna come back when i make some progress because this is a bit overwhelming like there's so much stuff and i'm like where am i gonna put it like i know where i'm gonna put it but these bins only hold so much i ordered four more so that'll definitely help but for now i still want to get this stuff off the counter so i'll be back hey y'all happy thursday welcome to another day y'all i'm hoping this is a continuation or else just take this as an intro if not girl just keep going keep watching um so today is thursday i'm sitting at my desk about to i want to put my nails on i made me some press ons last night y'all your girl is back not last night but like yesterday but your girl is back i did me some real simple light work little pink a little gold chrome on your girl is a chrome lover and i did my toes to match but you're gonna have to pay for that okay but anyways right now it is what time is it it's almost 10 o'clock my i ordered groceries uh, just a little little order from Kroger. So they're on the way through Instacart. Um, I'll show you the couple of things I got. I say couple and y'all might be like, a couple is two, girl. This is more than two. I'm loving my office. I feel like a big boss sitting at my desk or whatever. Ah, I love it. <laughs> um, but today's agenda. So I want to go in the garage and get a couple things. The kids' TVs, my mixer I'm looking for. And then I'm looking for my upholstery cleaner because I want to clean the bottom stair. I also want to do like some everyday cleaning around the house and go upstairs and <laughs> unpack my closet. I know the last time we left off, I was organizing my um, bathroom under the cabinets. Y'all, I did not finish, okay? I told y'all I had ordered some more of those containers. Well, they came and they've been sitting here for like three business days. So I need to get a move on that. Um, so I do plan to finish that organization today. I do plan to unpack my closet today because we recycle in the same three outfits. Me and my husband, we sick of it. We got all these clothes we recycle it like five outfits total like <laughs> so if you're like did she have that shirt on yesterday maybe mind your business <laughs> but um so i definitely want to get my uh closet unpacked and yeah i think that's about it some cleaning some unpacking just more house stuff okay so yeah i don't know if i'm about to put my nails on right now just because i know the groceries are like it says 10 minutes away so i think i'm gonna wait get the groceries i need to prep my nails that's the most important part like if you are a press on girly or like you didn't try press ons in the past and they never stuck to your nail it's likely your prep you got to make sure you prep your nails like i like to do some cuticle cleaning dehydrate my nails um i have some dehydrated but you can use alcohol or acetone to dehydrate your nails like push them cuticles back make sure you buffing off the shine and then I put glue on the nail and on the press on and on my natural nails. So that's just a little, just, just lock that in, okay? Next time you're trying your press on. So I'm gonna put these on because I want it to feel, feel a little some, some cute because I've been just having things working against me lately. We ain't gonna talk about that. But yeah, I'm gonna have to get some water in my system, some tea in my system. I met this lady 
she came over here to get some boxes and y'all she was a bodybuilder <laughs> and she was a personal trainer y'all she was so fit the first thing i said when she got out of her car was like dang she's fit like naturally so of course i'm talking to her because like my husband's setting up my treadmill perfect timing um, you know, so like <laughs> I work out a little bit girl, but like, how do I get my legs like yours? <laughs> but anyway, we were talking about just like fitness and stuff. And she told me about some stuff called regular girl. I don't know if y'all heard of it, but it's supposed to help you with your like digestion and being regular. If you know what I mean? Cause I'm not regular. So I've been taking it today's day three. I put it in this water bottle. It's clear. It's supposed to be like tasteless, whatever. Um, I can taste it. Every time something say tasteless, you're like, I can taste it. Okay. It's, it's not tasteless. It, it's not a bad taste. It's just like, I know something is in my water taste. So yeah, I'm gonna drink this. You're supposed to put it in like six to eight ounces of water. I don't know. I just had this leftover. So I, I'm using this, but I mean, it's not bad to drink. I've been drinking every day. I can say that I feel like it does work. You know, all the reviews say, oh, it's going to work in like 15 minutes. Not with this body child. It's 15 hours. But it do eventually work. So if you're trying to be a regular girl like me, check that out. I'm going to link it in the description box. This is not sponsored, okay? I just be liking to let y'all know some stuff that worked for me. Sorry, I keep looking at my phone. My Instacart is likely outside. So I'm going to get off of here, bring the groceries in, and then I'll show y'all what I got. All right, y'all. I got the bag. So <clears throat> I'm going to show y'all what I got real quick. I got some brown sugar cinnamon coffee pods. These are the Starbucks ones. I just wanted to try them. I also got some Immune Zoom tea. This is the organic traditional medicinal one. Love it. Ritz crackers. In this bag, I just got a bunch of these. Like, I've never seen these light and fit remix ones. These are like the ones I used to get from Walmart, but look how cute. So I got these yogurts. I really like these, y'all. So I got strawberry cheesecake <clears throat> for those. And then I got four of these blueberry almond oat crisp. That sounds so good. I'll let y'all know if I like them. Next, oops. We have, oh, I got some ginger honey tea. <clears throat> I'm a tea girl, if you haven't noticed. Got some salted caramel sugar-free syrup. And then I got four cans of these sliced pears and light syrup. My daughter likes these. Next. Oh, these all fell out the bag, but I got my kids these PJ Mask uh, yogurts. Yup. They're all like out the bag. That's fun. It's fine. We're gonna take them out anyway. And then also I got some caramel macchiato zero sugar creamer, the Starbucks one. This bag, ding. I don't know, these were cute. So I got these unicorn like little baby cakes for my kids, specifically my daughter. Y'all, I wanted to try these. Okay, they got me. These are dill pickle pretzel twists. I'll let y'all know. <laughs> but I wanted to try these. Maybe we'll try them together. And then Jolly Rancher, um, what are these? The chew? My husband likes these. I always try to get him something he likes. And then I got some grape jelly. This bag here is nothing but Lunchables for my kids. Like a whole bunch of Lunchables. We gonna move on. Oh goodness gracious. Woo. Arm workout. All right, apple juice. Times two. And then cran apple. We ain't had no juice. And this one is some, um, y'all we was running out, so I needed like a soap refill. And then I got a Airwick like starter kit. And then I also got like the, the refill. So this one is Fresh Waters, never tried it. I'm usually like a uh, Febreze plug-in girl, but Airwick is way, way cheaper. So we got this, okay. And then I got me some of these cold relief tablets. They're just like knockoff alka seltzers. I like them, they do the job. Also got Bounty paper towels. The triple rolls, cause I like those. They last a long time. Got the Roaring Water Value Pack. Sprite Zero, Seven Up Zero. The only thing that I don't have to show y'all in the house is two cases of water. They still outside on the porch, child, cause mm -mm. I, got, I get the like 40 packs, so they heavy. My husband's gonna come down and bring those inside. But yeah, that's my little grocery haul, y'all. <laughs> $200 and I'm like, where? But that's just how life goes. But I'm gonna put my little stuff away and then we're gonna get started on that to-do list, okay? Not that I needed any more yogurt, but you'll see when I start 75 soft, I eat yogurt every day.
How about you, some candy? Thank you. They didn't have those other gummies you like, but I try to always buy my man some candy at the store, y'all. See, it's a little dancey, happy. <laughs> Bae, you gonna try these dill pickle things with me? He's like, absolutely not. You gonna try one on no. camera with me? Oh, no. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? Yeah, my husband do not like pickled nothing. He is not a pickle person. I get it though, I get it. All right, y'all, let's put this stuff in the pantry. Oh yeah, let me take y'all in here and show y'all like the couple things that I changed. All right, y'all, in the pantry, and I'm about to show y'all how it's looking in just a minute. But for now, we're gonna go ahead and restock this stuff. I put some of the bins in here. I know the lighting is trash. It's a pantry, you know, it's a pantry. We're figuring out how to change these lights. So just bear with us. I've been stealing the pantry containers and using them in my office, but yeah. it was fun while well, last it. These are cute. We'll see if my daughter likes them. I don't know. Well, here's the pantry. I know last time I was showing y'all me putting some stuff in here, but this is just how it's looking. I'm gonna put all that water in these baskets so they can go. But yeah, um, I have the beans in here now. So it looks so much better. Cans are here. And then like, I still have to like put cereal and flour and all of that kind of stuff in their beans. But for now, yeah, it's looking, it's looking better. It's looking better. I like these. I put those little um, bag clips I bought in there. Just random stuff, y'all. Some drink mix stuff. And then this one is literally cement. So yeah, I'm not done. We have so much space in here. You know, we're, we're getting there. Where else am I gonna put it? So y'all might think this weird, but this area right here is gonna be like a coffee station. Excuse my children. But I'm using this kind of like as a multi-purpose drawer since it's so big. So half of this is like my junk drawer. And then this part is obviously going to be like teas and coffees. I was on Amazon. I found something to put my coffees in. So now I'm just going to have to find something else to put my teas in. Just because it opens like this and it's not really practical for a drawer. I mean, I guess I could pop this lid off and keep this. That's an option. Maybe I'll do that um, and just push it to the back here and then I'll put a couple things here for my coffee but I'm more of a tea drinker I just like to have coffee in the house for those rare days where I want some and excuse the shoes I have to measure and order for like some type of mudroom bench storage thing so that's what's going on with that but yeah multi-purpose most of these drawers are so big like this one it has my spices so I'm thinking I'm gonna like shift these over and then use this side for like Ziploc bags, like a Ziploc bag, like the organizers, and they have all the different size bags. I think that'll be a good idea. Also, I forgot to show y'all, I did get a fly swatter or two fly swatters because tis the season for flies. So yeah, I've already had to kill like two. So here we go. About to be on like Donkey Kong up in here with them flies. I'm sure there's a better way to open this, but yeah, this is my way. Let's see what it smell like. That smells pretty good. It smells fresh. What is this, fresh waters? Is that what I said? Um, I tore up the paper, so I don't remember, but I think it's fresh waters. I think I'm gonna put, oh, geez, one of these upstairs somewhere. I'm trying to see if there's an outlet in the hallway, I don't remember. But one of these is going downstairs and we don't want it on high because talk about a headache. So like, medium low, boom. Yep, right here seems as good of a place as any. Boom, make it smell good in here. Hey guys. Hey. You look so cute. What you doing? Also something that I just thought was so cute. I got these like uh, straw cap covers here and look how adorable. So I just like push this on my straw like so. And then you can cover your straw. Tell me this is not the cutest thing. I had the green one on for a few days and it was a vibe, but now, let me move this lamp. What are you doing? Still in the shine, literally. But I thought these were cute. I like it a lot. Oh, this is my little cuppy whip. So cute. And I don't know, it just makes me feel good when I'm leaving my cups sitting around. Like there's no dust getting in here, no buggy bugs or whatever. As you could think, ain't no bugs in your house, but as soon as you open the door, it's a few flies somewhere. <laughs> Spider or some girl. 
So this is cute. So now my dilemma is go ahead and put my nails on or get some housework done. The Instacart lady was super duper nice y'all. I've been meeting such nice people. Like such nice people here. But anyways, um, I'll be back when I'm actually doing something, okay? I feel like I'm having the most unproductive day ever, but I just sat here for like, I don't know how long in the zone, like prepping my nails to put on and then like applying them. So like, she's back, here are my nails. I did something really easy. I made these yesterday and I was so excited to put them on today. So yeah, I feel like she's back. And I just been going with short. I do like medium length nails, but like while I'm in the process of like getting stuff together in the house, I've been going with short nails because yeah, they're just easier. And you see like, they're not that long. You can see like my natural nail under there, maybe, possibly. But yeah, these aren't super long, but they're a really good length though, for short. Like they're a good everyday type of length. Um, I can work with these. They don't get in my way. Yeah, so I like them. Um, I gotta find my water because I'm really slow on my water intake today. Um, and I need to get my butt upstairs and get started on my closet. So now that it is 12 o'clock, sheesh. Um, and all I've done is um bring the groceries in, put them away, um, put my nails on, and oh, I vacuumed the stairs. So I vacuumed all the way up the stairs and kind of the hallway upstairs. So that was good. That was a workout. But um, yeah, so I did a little bit, but I wasn't about to show y'all me trying to struggle, set up a tripod, vacuum the stairs, but I did vacuum the stairs and I also vacuumed the living room rug. So now like, Hopefully next time y'all see me, we upstairs unpacking these boxes in the closet because once those two boxes are done, I want to say there's only one small like nightstand box of mine and my husband and that should pretty much be it. No, mm -mm, there's a box in the laundry room that I need to tackle too. So yeah, let's try to get these boxes out of here before the weekend. Like I'm trying. Also, we've been listing our boxes just for free on next door. And that's been working out because like a neighbor will come and like get them a bunch of boxes. Um, we had somebody last week. Somebody may come today because we have a ton of boxes. So we've just been giving them away. And I know boxes are very expensive. And yes, I can charge for them. But I don't know. It's just my way of giving back. So if you need some moving boxes, <laughs> I would say if you live close to me. But obviously, I'm not about to tell y'all where I stay. So yeah. Um, so that's been cool. Like we're able to get rid of the boxes as we unpack them. Um, so that they're not just stacking up and accumulating in the garage. Also, I would remind me if this vlog ends and I haven't shown y'all like how we set up my little gym area, please remind me. Okay, please. Also, my walking pad came. I'm so disappointed because the walking pad came and excuse me. And it was dirty. It was used. Like it had hair all over it. It was disgusting. Amazon, you should be ashamed. Because I ordered, sorry, my lips are so dry. Sidebar, I got this lip gloss from The Gloss Company. I met her on Threads, y'all. Go on Threads and meet you some friends. But I got this from The Gloss Company. She's on Instagram, The Gloss Company. I'll link her. But um, small business, period. Um, and I got like three glosses from her. Very affordable prices, really good stuff. Feels good on my lip. I feel like it doesn't give me that like, white crust you know what i'm talking about that lip gloss we doing and it's not as sticky so i really like it so check it out but anyway back to the walking pad so yeah i had to return that and now i'm waiting on a new one which won't come until next week sometime so yeah um hopefully it's here before i start 75 soft if not it's okay i can go out in the garage and work out no big deal but i was super excited for it to come just for it to be like nasty and used and i don't want something that came with hair like why i come like that <laughs> but anyway let me get this stuff cleaned back up and then we're gonna go upstairs y'all it is like way way later i'm talking like 8 p.m I ain't did nothing today to hold me to it. I was like, oh, next time y'all see me, I'll be upstairs. About that. Anyways, it's been a good day. <laughs> I'm finally about to try these because I just remembered I had them. I figured let's try them together. They smell good. I mean, I 
getting like, okay, there we go. I'm like, where's the pickle flavor? All right. Who want, you want to try them to see? It's a pretzel. It's a pickle pretzel. Wanna try it? Mm -hmm. See, you gonna try it with me. Let me know if you like it. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> It's good to me. They good to me. It's not like a pretzel. Like a dill pickle chip. But it's a pretzel. Tastes weird. That's good. Literally, it's not like a dill pickle chip, but it's a pretzel. Eat it, Mom. <laughs> Does she want me to eat hers? No. <laughs> it's like a dill pickle lays. It does taste like lays. No. What does it taste like to you? I don't know. I couldn't sit here and like eat the whole bag in one sitting. But they're good. Like, I like dill pickle everything. These right here, pretty good to me. Let me know if you've tried them. My family, they don't like pickles, y'all, so. Of course, they're not gonna like them. But anyway, I ain't gonna sit here and make y'all no promises. Like, oh, later on, we're gonna do X, Y, Z. We ain't. Not tonight, we ain't. <laughs> My little girl wants something to eat. Of course, after we fed her dinner, got her everything she asked for, she wants something else. So, with that being said, we're gonna go, have a good night, end our night, and I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye. Say bye. bye. Say see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Mwah. I love you. Hey y'all, happy Saturday. Um, Today is the day y'all I've been telling y'all for days like, oh, we're about to go upstairs and do the closet. But today we're actually going to work on the closet. So, um, I'm sitting on my bed right now, like contemplating life. There's one box over there uh, for the nightstand, so I'll probably tackle that too. And my husband finally put together those little organizers for the bathroom. I'll show y'all in just a minute. So I can go ahead and like reorganize that middle section. And then I got my other clear containers that I need to just put together and get the rest of my stuff together. So I'm going to work on all of that but yeah let's go and see like kind of what the hold on my lens was like crooked but let's go see how the closet is looking um i really think that we took all the clothes off the hanger um to like save space and boxes and stuff but man now i'm gonna have to put everything back on the hanger so you know so it might take a little a while and I'm thinking I may need to go ahead and order another pack of hangers real quick. I'm going to go kind of look at the boxes and then see if I'll need some more. I may order another um, pack and hopefully it'll come today. The shipping here is amazing. Like this, the same day shipping. Oh my gosh. Best thing ever. <laughs> it's the best thing ever. I don't know how y'all don't be in trouble with same day shipping because like same day shipping be getting me. I be like, oh, I can get that today. I can get that today. And I just be buying it, okay? Let's go in here and see how everything is looking. All right, so in the bathroom. And these are the containers that I had in my old bathroom. I still love these because, you know, they pull out. They didn't work well with our other cabinet because it had this, like, thick part down there. So these will work better because I can pull these in and out and actually use them the way they're meant to be used. So that'll be nice. And then I have these. They look so good. So like I'll put some more on this side. I thought about stacking them up one more. So I might stack them up top and then just put two right here and then leave a little space on the side to like set stuff that's kind of tall. So we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. All right. So the biggest project is obviously going to be in this closet here today. This is how it is looking. These are the boxes that I'm going to go through. Um, we have these hangers here. My husband already started hanging some of his stuff up and my stuff. This is stuff that came on hangers. All my husband's, well, some of his shoes are down here and then my shoes are here so i'll be taking like this part of the closet and also like to here like half of this and then this part where those hangers are and around is my husband's if he needs some more space i may you know like to here because i, I don't have a whole bunch of clothes y'all and obviously we had a much smaller closet before so i don't think what's in these boxes it's going to like take all of this space, but we'll see. And obviously things can get pushed closer together. So let's get started. So the lighting in here is not the best, but we're gonna make do what we got. I'm actually gonna do my side first, my clothes first. Oh my gosh. My husband put a heavy sticker on mine, so yeah. I love having my nails done, but man, the like dull points, 
Makes it so hard to work with. Oh my goodness, like, be for real. I'm struggling with this tape today. I am struggling. All right, got it. So I put y'all up higher, like on my laundry hamper. So I don't know if my head will be cut off, but I'm just about to put some of these clothes on hangers real quick. Like somebody mama with this outfit on i am somebody's mama times two and he made me somebody mama you got jokes today don't you all right now y'all can see my face and the box i think oh you don't worry i ain't keeping grudges because i'm doing better life cannot be more golden but honestly i won't lie sometimes i ask why i can't get you out my head now i don't forget that i I wish I had my um, Echo up here so I could listen to some music. I wanted to check out Beyonce's new album. It came out yesterday, the 29th, but I just had a long, busy day yesterday and I didn't get to listen to it. So I definitely plan on listening to it today while I edit. Cause I'm trying to get a video out tomorrow. We'll see. But I really want to put a video out tomorrow. I'm trying to be consistent. I have the content. It's just a matter of like, making time to edit the content that's the problem because i'm filming so much and i have to get back to like business stuff and doing nails and stuff so it's been hard for me to like find pockets of time to do nails to edit videos to vlog videos to do everything else i need to do child it's hard so happy to see jeans again little business shirt my sister got this for well my sister made this for me um it just says vpp my business called bonds press perfections look how cute i have another one somewhere
got me feeling blue Something but you saw see through Something just ain't right for you gotta hang up my activewear stuff i'm gonna do that off camera just to say battery because i'm running out of room on this sd card so i'll come back and show y'all the progress all right y'all i'm about to take y'all in here and show y'all the progress i've made i still have some laundry to do so i'm definitely gonna have more clothes to hang up later also over there on my bed is like all the stuff i got out of the box that goes in my dresser so i'll get those put away here in just a minute um off camera though because yeah y'all don't see all that so this is how it's looking here, this is gonna be my side. Like I got my pants here and then shirts kinda sorta categorized. And then like this is gonna be my husband's space. Hopefully he don't need more space, he might y'all. And then here is like my long stuff. So like robes, I have a few long dresses, jackets, um, long sleeves is here and then my sweats. And then over here, these are like my active wear clothes, which I desperately need more. Like I be washing like crazy when I'm working out every day. I do have more active wear clothes, like shorts and like tanks and stuff that I just fold up. So this is just the part I'll hang up. And then here's some extra hangers. Like I said, once I get done doing my laundry, I'm pretty sure I'll need those. It's looking so much better. Uh, we got to get some shoe organization going. I do have some ideas. I've seen some things online i'm even thinking about putting something here i'm either gonna put my long mirror here or i'm gonna get a shelf here for stuff i don't know yet but yeah this looks so much better and like i said we're probably gonna do some like bottom shelving for like shoes and stuff so stay tuned hey y'all i just want to hop on real quick because i'm editing and i realized i forgot to actually end the video i'm trying to be better about that so Thank y'all so, so much for watching. I know this is a long one. We got a lot done. I'm feeling so good about how things are coming along in the house. So make sure you subscribe if you want to see more. Stay tuned in with me, y'all. There's so much more content coming. Don't forget to like the video. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Thank y'all so, so much for all the love, all the support, all my new subbies. I see y'all. I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.